Hello, Alex. I thought I might uh, pretend this was a Halloween costume and say I'm dressed as like a Ferris wheel or a neon display sign. Like, you know, those old timey ones that are outside of like theaters and other places and you're in like a city. Gosh, ugh, this is not well thought out. And neither was this costume. It's not even really a costume. It's it's just an excuse for me to not turn on the lights because I'm I'm making this video very sleepy and I don't feel like like making it better lit. So instead we just have colorful light bulbs. <laughs> they don't like staying on very well. <laughs> That's why they're not a good costume. I don't really have any particular theme for this. I'm just kind of chatting a little bit. Can report this is not a trick-or-treating neighborhood, which is pretty much what I expected, but you know, now now I know for sure. So it turns out when you're not a kid and you're not dressing up and you don't get trick-or-treaters, Halloween is like a little less festive. It's mostly just a lot of sirens. It's been a very siren heavy night. And they're really are really not my favorite not my favorite nights overall. But it's worse for the people who need the sirens. I don't know. That makes Halloween a little bit, like, actually scary. I feel like the reason Halloween can be so fun ordinarily is because, like, it's scary or spooky or whatever kind of, you know, creepy, spooky language you want to use for it. But it's also, like, very fun and silly. It's like making scary things less scary. It's like turning them into something that's easier to deal with. And that can be really, really nice when you're used to scary things just being actual full-time scary to like move into this other realm of this is like so ridiculous and silly that like it would be scary, but it's also just kind of fun and weird and a time for you to just like kind of go crazy imagining stuff which I guess is why maybe it also feels like so much more of a kid holiday than some of the others but you know you grow up and they stay pretty similar versus Halloween like there's a lot of magic to it when you're a kid but I'm finding there's like less of as I get older but I really have enjoyed <laughs> that you and everybody else you know that we're friends with has has made it kind of a fun thing like making those halloween playlists i do really like them and appreciating halloween decorations and pumpkins and even folks who like wear a costume to work that's not me i'm not really that uh organized anymore i mean this is just just some good evidence of that i also listen to a lot of Taz amnesty again because i think that's especially the beginning arc like a nice balance of spooky but silly, you know, that feels classic Halloween, even if it's not really Halloween in the story. This, <laughs> There's no good way to get out of this video. I don't really know what I'm saying. Anyway, happy Halloween, Alex. Happy start of November. November. Ah. <sighs> Bye for now, friend. Really hope we get to talk this week.